Report, your weekly look at city news and events. The city previews the Living Green Master Plan at an open house on Wednesday, November the 23rd from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. at the Glass Pavilion on Mississauga Celebration Square. Good evening and welcome to Ion Sheridan. I'm Dario Roy. Ministry of Industry Tony Clement will be making a statement regarding the ongoing efforts to establish a global bank tax today. The theme of this year's conference is Rebel in celebration of the 175th anniversary of William Lyon Mackenzie's trek in Mississauga during the Rebellion of 1837. Unlike other naturopath clinics, In Good Hands uses a unique spin on spirituality to diagnose their clients. South Asian community is expected to increase to 4.1 million from 1.3 million in 2006. This means this minority group is going to double to 28% in 2031. Semantic says that per capita access to the internet through home connections and Wi-Fi hotspots increases the chances of the city's computers being prone to cybercrime. As long as you're, you stay persevered and you stay focused on your goals, there'll be rejection along the way, but you really have to stay focused on what you want. And um, that's how I see things now. And when I came back to Toronto, I created my own destiny and I realized I can't wait and sit for things to happen for me. I have to go out and find them. Um, I started networking, going to events, and I had an audition with Rogers. And currently, I actually work for a show called Access, PL as a reporter. And here with me now is Lucas Spiano. Welcome to Take 21. Thank you for having me. And I believe this is yours. <laughs> Thank you. In 2009, you were on the top political leaders of today. <laughs> How did it feel beating out Michael Moore? <laughs> Olivia Chow has been a member of parliament as well as an advocate for children and youth services in the NDP shadow cabinet. Before the child come into a school, we want to uh, make sure that it has good child care. Our response coordinator, Daryl Roy, had a chance to sit down with health expert, Dr. Oz. What would you see are the essential steps in achieving both physical and mental wellness? The, the number one thing is you've got to have the mind and the body work together, so understand a little bit about each of them. 